All right, guys, so you guys clicked on this video and you probably saw the thumbnail with the giant sword in it. And guys, well, it's not clickbait. I know a lot of you guys are probably thinking, Creep Craft, are you clickbaiting us? It's not. So I really did find an old jailbreak sword. Later on in the video, I'm going to go into detail and show you guys it. But I did find a sword and we're going to talk about it in this video. Before we get into that, though, there are a few things I do want to talk about first. So the first thing I want to talk about is my Twitter. We actually hit 100,000 followers over on my Twitter yesterday. In yesterday's video, I talked talked about this and said I'd be doing a huge giveaway over on Twitter when we hit 100,000 followers. And well, we're, we just hit it. We hit 100,000 followers. And later today, I'm going to be doing a huge giveaway on Twitter. So go check out my Twitter. That link's in the description. If you guys want to get in on that, I'll probably be giving away like a $10 or $25 Robux code. Obviously, I would do it right now, but it's currently like three in the morning and I don't want to you, wake you guys up or anything like that. I don't want you guys to wake up and be like mad at me for like, you know, notifications on on Twitter or anything like that. So we'll do it later on in the day. So stay tuned to my Twitter later on today. So the next thing I kind of want to talk about here is some big jailbreak, or not really jailbreak, but Roblox news. So, Bloxy news, big Roblox uh, news source, he tweeted this out literally like a few minutes ago, saying, saying that coming soon in Roblox, developers will have the option to offer a subscription service for their games to have users pay a monthly Roblox fee. And this is actually pretty crazy. As you guys can see, whenever you go to make a game, there's going to be a price down here, and it's going to have the duration of the month. So, basically what this means is some some games instead of costing let's say 25 robux to get into and to play like like Bloxburg, it may instead just cost five robux every month to play so i don't really know how you guys feel about this i think for some games this could work out pretty well for other games it could work out yeah not so well i think the question is and you guys can let me know down in the comment section below would you guys like to pay five robux a month to play Bloxburg instead of just paying 25 dollars or 25 Robux. That way it's cheaper to play the game, but I guess over time it is more expensive. I, I don't know. What do you guys think? Let me know down in the comment section below. Okay, so I know that wasn't really jailbreak update related, but it does have something to do with Roblox and it was pretty big, so I thought I'd throw it in there, but let's talk about the update now. So yesterday, Asimo tweeted this out here, guys. It's this tweet saying that coming in today's update, and it is coming today, we've got some company coming this weekend jailbreak. They're not here to stay, but to drop off a new item. The new item will reveal itself sometime in the upcoming weeks and of course it's a picture of the ship that you guys probably saw on the thumbnail now like i mentioned before this is going to be a brand new event and once the event ends it's going to reveal a new item well guys i'm pretty sure i figured out what that new item is so i've done some digging on old roblox because i i, I swore a long time ago there was a knife or some sort of sword in the game files and well guys there is a knife and there is a sword in the game files for roblox jailbreak it's just obvious Obviously, in Jailbreak currently, there is no knife or sword or anything like that. And real quick, I do want to show you guys some evidence of it being in the game. So right here is the police station. It was one of the first things added into the game. Like, literally, this thing came when the game launched. And if we look at the weapon wall here, you're going to notice a few things. So we've got the flashlight here added on the right. And then everything else is stuff that was pretty much in the game from the get-go. We've got the shoddy, which was in the game from the start. The, the pistola, the flashlight, which... I believe was in the game from the start or it might have been added a little bit later on. We've got the police uniform, the SWAT outfit, you know, the SWAT rifle, shoddy, all that stuff. But check this out. So right here, guys, is the exact same pistola. It's the SWAT pistola right here two times. So why would there be a need for there to be two slots for the same pistola when it's literally right here next to each other? That doesn't really make a lot of sense. And well, guys, I'm pretty sure the reason for this is because it was originally going to be a knife or sword a uh, sword sword <laughs> sword uh, i can't talk sword slot that is very hard to say a sword slot say that like five times fast in the comments and let me know if you guys can do that but anyway i'm pretty sure that one of these was originally going to be a sword slot now if you don't believe me you can go to the gel break uh actual gel little prison thing here the little police station in the prison and you can see the same thing right on over here is the exact same weapon two times right next to each other there's no other item in the game that is like that we have the police section and the swap section so why in the world is there two of the exact same weapon right next to each other it doesn't make a lot of sense so i did some digging from way back when literally like two years ago and there's nothing on this on the wiki guys i had to go deep uh, deeper than that a lot further than that so obviously on the wiki here we got the pistola we've got the rifle the shoddy the ak the rockets the grenades the the uzi um the the swatty pistola the turret all this stuff that's currently in the game but if we search on the wiki for the knife or 
for the sword. There's nothing mentioning it on the wiki. So I'm pretty sure I'm like the only person in the world that remembers this. But anyway, guys, I did some digging and I found this image right here. Okay, this image right here of some old jailbreak items that were going to be put in the game. So basically what this is, is this is the original art that the Simo and Bad CC had made. I forget who made it. So if you guys know, let me know down in the comment section below. But this is the original art for the hot bar items in the game. So for example, we got the Pistola, the security clearance key card, the binoculars, the taser, the shoddy, the flashlight, the AK, the handcuffs, the rifle, the money, and oh, what's that? Is that a, is that a sword? Is that a knife? Wait a minute, Creecraft, you weren't clickbaiting us. That's actually a sword. And well, yes, guys, so originally whenever Jailbreak was first coming out, there was going to be a sword or a knife. I don't know if that's a sword or a knife. It looks like a sword to me, so I'm going to say it's a sword, but it looks like a sword. And uh, whenever they originally commissioned the artist or paid the artist to make all the hot bar items, they had them make a sword because they expected a sword to be in the game. So just to prove to you guys that this is the hot bar items, I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to equip all the items right here just so you can see that it's the exact same items here. So you can see, you can compare them. We got the pistola. We have the handcuffs right there. The tasers right there. The shoddy, the flashlight, the binoculars. It's literally the exact same. The money icon over there below my face. Okay, so you guys are convinced. So Creekraft, what happened to the sword? Why is the sword not in the game? Why are we two years into the game, two and a half years into the game, and there's no sword or knife in the game? What in the world happened to it? And well, to be honest, I have no idea. But being that the new ship that's coming into the game is going to be dropping off a new item, not a new vehicle, not a new weapon or, or anything like that, but a new item. And obviously that item has to be related to pirates, okay? So it's probably not going to be, you know, like some sort of sniper rifle because pirates don't have that. They have stuff like swords. And well, I mean, you be the judge, but that certainly does look uh, kind of like a pirate sword to me. No, of course, the other options is some sort of like flintlock weapon or like a hand cannon or something like that. But my guess is that it's going to be the sword. That's the item the pirates are going to be dropping off into the game. Now, what I've went ahead and done is I've loaded up a Roblox Studio jailbreak map to kind of just show you guys what these swords could possibly look like. So I just grabbed a few from Studio. Obviously, these aren't the actual swords. These are just swords I, I pulled from Studio to show you guys what they're kind of like. So I found one right here. This is more like a little like realistic sword. Obviously, this is how it would work in jailbreak, how it would look and stuff. Uh, right here, we have more of a, a pirate sword. I think this is probably the most likely item to be added into the game, a sort of like pirate sword going on here because it fits the theme of the pirate ship and the pirates. And then just for fun and giggles, we've got cloud sword here because, you know, why not? And then obviously a more type of uh, long sword here that you see in a bunch of other Roblox type games. Obviously, these swords don't really look, uh, you know, too similar to this sword. This is more like a machete, but I want to throw these in here anyway to just give you guys an idea of how this would look in the game. So now the question is, what do you guys think? Do you guys think it's a sword? Have I convinced you? Are you guys convinced? Do you believe me that the sword's going to be coming into the game? Obviously, I could be wrong. This is just speculation. But I mean, let's be honest. What other items are pirates going to be dropping off into the map? Like, there's not much that pirates really have. They were pretty much just, you know, men in pants and trousers sailing through the ocean. So yeah, that's basically it for this video. Let me know what you guys think down in the comment section below. If I'm wrong, I'll eat a sock on live stream, okay? If I'm wrong, and, and I probably might very well, maybe, who knows, I'll eat a sock on live stream. But guys, if you guys enjoyed this video and you guys are new and you haven't yet subscribed, go ahead and hit that red subscribe button underneath the video. It is free and that way you'll be notified of all future videos. You're going to hit the bell icon, turn on your notifications. You guys know the drill. We're going to be doing a huge Roblox jailbreak update stream later today. Bad to see is going to be there. You guys know how it works. Basically, we live stream jailbreak all night long, waiting for the update to come out. We test it with the Simo and Bad CC. It's always a lot of fun and you definitely don't want to miss it. So make sure you guys are subscribed for that. Hit the like button on the video and if you do buy robux or use my star code uh do tweet me a picture of it it's star code real creek so use that when buying your robux or your builders club and then tweet me a photo of it and i'll like it follow you guys on twitter all that awesome stuff star code real creek but thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys later today for the roblox shellbreak update Bye.